Hey, party people! <laughs> so yesterday, you guys heard from Shaleen Johnson. Um, I know it was really long, but her information in there was so crucial. Because of what Facebook and Instagram and all of the social media platforms is doing, is we're getting inundated with just garbage, right? Garbage of people posting salesy posts all the time, trying to sell me this, trying to sell me that. Well, times are changing and we really need to focus. And I've, I, I truly believe our team and myself have always done it this way. We've always tried to build our brand and, and share with people who we are before we try to have them join us for anything. Because honestly, that's what this is about. I got into it to help people and to serve people and to love people. And if it's with Beachbody, great. But I don't know that until I build that relationship. And they don't trust me until we build a relationship, right? So that's what curiosity marketing is all about. And really making a conscious effort to share what you're doing without giving it all away. So Shalene shared all of that with you guys. But I kind of want to break this down because in our sheet that we have, it says... Um, Yesterday you learned about lifestyle posts and I gave examples with Shalene's video, right? Um, so you guys are familiar now, every single day you're going to create a lifestyle post for you to post, right? So um, using one of the examples, making it your own for yourself and then posting it. Today we're gonna talk about fitness and nutrition posts. So how do we incorporate fitness and nutrition into our daily posting schedule? Um, you do not want to showcase the product. Like Shaleen said, we need to be creative in the way we share our fitness and wellness stuff. So every day you need to post at least one. Um, it's so, so, so important because people need to know what you're doing. They are not gonna, they can't just guess, right? They need to know that you're on a wellness journey, right? That you are doing certain things. You need to provoke questions. So you want them to ask you questions. So I'm gonna include some examples of fitness and nutrition posts. But what I do, and a lot of others, we post a meal. You can post a um, picture of what you're eating and you wanna make sure you do it in the right lighting and you'll learn more about lighting in the, new, the coach training that you go on after this and how to make the pictures pretty and all of that. But, um, you want to be in natural light. So what I like to do is I take my lunch and I always use a white plate and I, it's not like it looks so pretty. Like I'm not a, a great cook by any means, but I make, you can create it to look nice. So I put it in the white dish. I put it on, um, in the sunlight on a, a wood table and I take a picture and it's very simple and a lot of veg, it's vegetable based. So the colors really pop and it looks good right? It looks good on social media. So I share what I'm eating. I also share a fitness post so I can do a fitness tip, um, that like a fitness move. I could do a fitness video, a video of me doing, um, a little workout and that's not necessary. You don't have to do that guys. So don't think like, Oh my gosh, I have to do a video of me working. No, you don't have to do that. But this is just an option if that's your thing. Okay. Um, you can do, a uh, post about like new sneakers that you bought that you love and people will start asking you the brand and what kind they are, where you got them. People love to talk about clothing. So you can do like a fitness, a post about like your favorite um, pants, your favorite workout pants. And they'll, don't say where they're from. You just can pose in them and people will ask, you know, or you can just fold, show them folded up nice on a table and say, I love these pants. These are the bomb. I could get them in every color. And then people are going to be like, well, what are they? What are... And you're going to spark conversation. And that's what you want to do. You don't want to give it all away, right? You talk about your program that you're doing. You talk about it in a, a way that, you know, I just killed my workout today. It was, it's getting easier every day. And I'm just so proud of myself. And I'm proud of the women that I'm doing it with and take a picture of your workout mat or your workout area or a picture of your face, yourself. That's okay too. 
you know? And people are gonna be like, well, what are you doing? And ask you questions. And that's when you bring it into a private message and just you start asking them questions. Like, oh, I'm just loving what I'm doing. Are you working out now too? And it's so easy to just start that conversation, okay? I'm gonna include examples below so you guys get a feel of what we're looking for and then I want you to put one together and I want you to share one below too. So we can kind of, we want, what I wanna do is say yes, no, let's tweak that, let's change it up so you guys get the right vibe when you start this business right away. I don't want, like so many times in the past, people are posting this, this, and this, and then they really, so they're posting all this stuff and that's not really what they should be posting. So I want you guys to learn right now so you can then move forward and you get it. Like you wanna be yourself in your post. You can, if you're funny, showcase your personality, showcase your energy. Take those things about yourself, the characteristics, that people like about you, like your friends like about you, and use it on your social media, okay? So that's fitness and nutrition posts. You should be doing one a day. Not one nutrition and one fitness, but one combined. Fitness, nutrition, wellness is fine. You could share an article once in a while or a funny video of someone working out in the gym, like doing like, they're funny. Like, have you ever seen those working out in the gym and they're not doing the move correctly? <laughs> <laughs> they're really funny. You could showcase funny stuff like that, but you don't wanna do the, that every single day. You know what I'm saying? So always changing it up. And it takes time to get this, but once you get it, it starts to come naturally and easy, and it doesn't take you long to think of a post. All right, guys, I wanna see them below.